Forbidden Planet is a 1956 science fiction classic filmed in Eastman Color and Cinemascope. The movie was directed by Fred Wilcox, who also directed Lassie Come Home in 1943. The film stars Walter Pidgeon as Dr. Edward Morbius and his daughter, Altair, played by Anne Francis. Also starring is Leslie Nielsen as Commander John Adams and Warren Stevens, who plays Lieutenant Doc Ostow. And look for Earl Holloman, who plays the ship's cook. The story takes place in the 23rd century. The starship C-57D is on a mission to Altair IV to locate and find survivors of an expedition sent there 20 years earlier. After arriving at Altair IV, the ship comes in contact with Dr. Morbius and is told not to land, but Commander Adams ignores his warning and lands the ship. Morbius sends out Robbie the robot to meet the ship and transports them to the compound. When they meet Morbius and his daughter Altair, the doctor explains what happened to him and his party and how they survived with the help of a race of aliens called the Krell, a highly advanced race that perished over 200 years ago. When Dr. Morbius shows the commander and the lieutenant a Krell laboratory, Morbius shows them the educator, a device capable of measuring and enhancing intellectual capacity. Adams has orders to bring back all known survivors, but Morbius rejects this and tells Adams him and his daughter are not leaving. That's when the crew begin to be killed and Adams finds out it's Dr. Morbius's id. He calls monsters from the id. It's Morbius's own subconscious mind that's killing the crew. This movie has excellent acting, great special effects, and good action. So check this film out on DVD or Blu-ray, and I'll see you in the next video.